spending a lot of time on the end of this dock just because I'm trying to evaluate what to do. I've never gone this way before. I've always looped around up to that tower. But I know there's like a pl little mini group of guards that like circles around that area, so I I don't know. Let's try something new. Oh my fucking god, Altair. Oh, oh, please don't move unless I hit the fucking button. You're gonna kill me one day, man. None of you will lift a hand in defense of your master. I'll take care of this heathen myself. Not him. What makes you think I want to lock the guy behind me? That's some Dark Souls bullshit right there. Fuck me. Oh my god. I hope he doesn't see me. Like, I've never ever gone this way before. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I don't know where he is. I don't know where to go. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just... Can't go anywhere over here. Unless I risk drowning again. That's the first time I've fallen in the water and drowned in AC in a long time. One. Two. Three. And run. Okay. <laughs> oh, Tyre, why do you must you always aim for the edge of things? <sighs> I've never been more scared of water in any game except this game. You know what? Screw the rest of the pegs. We're going to climb up here. All right. Plan. Plan. And I think this might work. I've never, ever tried this before, but we're going to see if it works. We're going to wait for Sabran to loop back around, and once he has his back to me at the edge of the boat, I'm going to go up behind him and stab the crap out of his spine. That's what I'm going to do. Here he comes. Fine! Oh my god. None of you... Yes! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy that worked. That was a brand new thing. I've never tried that before. Of course I am afraid. But you'll be safe now, held in the arms of your god. Have my brothers taught you nothing? I know what waits for me. For all of us. If not your god, then what? Nothing. Nothing waits. And that is what I fear. You don't believe. How could I, given what I know? What I've seen? Our treasure was the proof. Proof of what? That this life is all we have. Linger a while longer, then, and tell me of the part you were to play. A blockade by sea. Shut up, Altair, I had it right. <laughs> keep the fool kings and queens from sending reinforcements. Once we... Once we... Conquered the Holy Land? Freed it, you fool. From the tyranny of faith. Freedom? You worked to overthrow cities, control men's minds, murdered any who spoke against you. I followed my orders. Believing in my cause. Same as you. The only reason I ever felt bad for killing Sabran was just because of how scared he was to die. Well, I. Oh, fuck you! No touching the robes, assholes! Alright, now there's the question of getting off the fucking boat. Ah! I will confess that was maybe the second time I've ever been able to accomplish that stealthily. MOVE! Can you- You guys are fucking inferior to me in every way whatsoever and I hate you! Move! Oh my god, they're all right behind me! MOVE! RUN AWAY! There's no point in hiding until I get out of here. Okay, now I can focus on hiding. <laughs> Not the flag. Oh, hi. Assassino, assassino. Ecosi, shoot, shoot the flying demon. Alright, I did it! Whoopee! 
That was a line from uh, Assassin's Creed 2, in case y'all didn't pick that up. That's coming up next, as soon as I beat this replay. I don't know what any of that- what the fuck are you doing? We have a mime in training here, pretending to climb ladders that aren't there. You talented son of a bitch. Ow, my legs. I probably should have stayed up on the roof, not like it was my choice to get down, but still. Alright, let's head back up. We're close. We're right there, in fact. Oh, I did it! I did it stealthily! I now have a new route planned out for killing Zabrand, and I am very proud of myself. Yay! Hello. Altair, you've caused quite a stir. Oh, I'm sure. I've done as requested. Sabran's life is ended. So it is. So it is. You should ride for Masiaf and inform Al Muallim of your success. I will. Yes. I should return and speak to him. Of this and other things. Is everything all right, my friend? You seem distant. It's nothing, Rafiq. Just a lot on my mind. Talk to me then. Let me help. I need to make sense of this myself first. But thank you for the offer. It is the men you kill, isn't it? You feel something for them. How? Ah, my friend. You are not meant to enjoy these grim tasks. Regret, uncertainty, sympathy. This is to be expected. I should not fear these feelings. You should embrace them. They are what keep you human. What if I'm wrong? Stretch out with your feelings. What if these men are not meant to die? What if they mean well? Misguided, perhaps, but pure in motive. I am but a Rafiq, Altair, and such things are beyond me. Perhaps Al Mualim can help you to make Here, sense. Here, man, let me offer to yes. help, but <laughs> I'm just Rafiq, so don't Thank take my you, advice. Rafiq. It is my pleasure to have served with one as skilled as you. Aw, oh, shucks. Thank you. Now all that's left is to get Malik back on my side. Can you get rid of the invisible door here, buddy? I'd love to I'd love to rest. Please. Thank you. Fast forwarding memories <laughs> to a more recent one. Alright. Target number eight has been eliminated. We have but one or <laughs> two left. And we're going back to Desmond first. Not a lot of time, but oh, I had a fuck. Wherever Who's talking? Hidden, time to retrieve it. Working on it. And when it's done. He'll be taken care of. I want that progress report by tomorrow morning. That better not mean what I think it means, you bastards. I've got some work I need to do. <gasps> I'm fucking dizzy. So you've got the rest of the night to yourself. That's lovely. You got like an MS space and I could borrow real quick because I'm feeling not good at all. Ugh. Okay. Alright, Lucy. Good morning, afternoon, evening, whatever the hell it might be. Everything looks the same. Talk to me? Please? Talk. Thank you. I think there's a problem with the Animus. Nope. It's working fine. I'm pretty sure it just ejected me I'm when it- I'm pretty sure you should shut up. You ready to finally tell me what's going on? We have to stop them, Desmond. When they access that last memory of yours- It's a lovely pen. They're just getting started. They want to change everything. The way we live, the way we think, the way we are. You've gotten the lecture from Vidic about what's wrong with the world, how we need order and discipline, so they're going to give it to us. Only we don't have a say in the matter. That's fucked up. How? The Templar treasure. They think it... Miss Stillman? I'm here. I need you to upload Desmond's files to the database. Got it. Excuse, don't... Okay, hold on a second. Let me pick a wedgie. Don't walk away from me! I'm not done talking to you. We're in the middle of saying something about a Templar treasure, and I want to know more. I'd love to know more, so hurry up and sit your ass down so I can hit the button, please. Thank you. So what? You're using me to find this Templar treasure? What do they call it? The Peace of Eden? Yes. Well, it's looking like it's at Messiah, so I don't know why they're wasting all this time with me. Why don't they just send their people to pick it up? They can't. It's not that simple. The artifact from Messiah, they had it. It was destroyed in the accident. Then what are they hoping for me, you know, for my ancestor, to tell them? They're hoping he'll show them where the other ones are. You mean there's more than one of these things? Oh, Desmond, you have no idea. It's creepy to think about. Is there a problem with No, Willem. 
Everything's Denver on my end. Then, where are the files? You can have a bit of patience, you old fart bastard. I've got to move these files before he gets suspicious. We'll talk more later. But I want to talk now. Wait, what's that mean, everything's Denver? It means everything's fine. Why Denver? It's a reference to Denver International Airport. There's an underground facility there. It's where the accident happened. I'm still not 100% clear on what exactly happened, but I want to do some more research. So, to the Assassin's Creed Wiki as soon as I'm done with this. Aren't you tired? Yes, as a matter of fact, I'm tired. So, we are going to go to bed. She sure got out of this room in a flash, just saying. Alright, now we're going to steal the beautiful pen. Now we have Warren's beautiful pen. Just kidding, she took it with her. Did I already steal the pen? I have a feeling I already stole the pen. I already stole the pen, didn't I? Yep, I'm a fucking idiot. Question mark, deleted items. And we've reached the bottom. Alright, so here's where it starts. To Lucy. From blank. Need intel on DIA event. Denver International Airport event. Lucy replies back, At least 20 dead in accident. Assume this is site of launch. If not launch, then certainly assembly. Should try and infiltrate. To Lucy. What is purpose of launch? From Lucy. Low Earth orbit transmitter for artifact. Extension of conditioned response experiments from five years ago. If successful, they control everything. To Lucy. What do you mean everything? From Lucy, our minds. To Lucy, what about Desmond? From Lucy, they're using him to locate another artifact. I've been delaying, but they're close now. To Lucy, does he know about us? From Lucy, no. To Lucy, good. Keep it that way for now. From Lucy, can you send rescue? To Lucy, problems down there. <laughs> Wonder why it is everyone laughs at you? I'll let you guess. Let's just say she's probably getting it bigger and better from someone else that isn't you. How can you hope to compete? Rest assured, there are some good ways. Click the link to see. And in all those hidden capital letters, it says, we will be there soon. Just saying. That's what it says. Because I read it before. I know what it says. So, if you know the other Assassin's Creed games, if you've played them before and know their stories, you know who she's communicating with. In her outbox. Case file. Uh, yeah, we've already read that. And five in the outbox. Newman dropped the company. And got up a Nothing new, just the deleted item. Alright. Now let's go check Vivi's computer and see if he's got anything new. From Alan to Warren. I've downloaded our analysis of. Wait, yes, from Alan to Warren. Warren, I've downloaded our analysis of your latest findings onto the secure terminal in the conference room. It's critical that you review it and get back to us with any additional comments. We cannot continue with the search until you sign off. Please make this a priority. And then from Warren to Alan, can't access the computer, it wants a password. From Alan, I'll call security for you. Check your email shortly. And then he emails 0006267. So now we have the uh, keypad password for the conference room. So hurrah. And then, god dang it. There we go. So, we've got another long freaking email chain, but I kind of like reading these. They're very interesting for lore. Holy freaking crap. Alright, so we read this whole thing. The classified information, blah blah blah, we read all that. And then, from Henry Lehman to Warren Vidic. Guess the shit's really hit the fan this time. Someone managed to leak a bunch of documents on the fluoride enhancement studies, and now the pharmaceuticals division is under investigation by the feds. They've shut the entire place down. Did you see what was in those reports? What the hell were they thinking? They pretty much poisoned an entire town. From Jane Burkham to Warren. Wow, you've been watching the news? Stock is going to take a hit from this for sure. Want to grab lunch today? And then from Alan to everyone, I assume. It's about those idiots in the pills division. We're putting out a press release about the satellite, telling them launch has been delayed until the 21st so that we can make improvements to the coverage area. Some stuff about less dropped calls. For the benefit of our consumers, of course. Let's just make sure you get what you need in time to meet the new launch window. 
Interesting. And then we have some more daily headlines. And this is what they were talking about. Hundreds hospitalized in wake of water tampering scandal. Abstergo Holdings stands accused of secretly manipulating a small town's water supply in order to test a synthetic drug referred to internally as new fluoride. And the nation mourns the loss of final film studio. History was made today with the closing of the country's last movie studio. The rising prominence of video games coupled with rampant piracy are considered to be the leading causes of its demise. <laughs> I always thought that one was funny. Annie. <laughs> my dog is down by my feet and she wants me to pet me. She wants me to pet her with my feet. So I'm like petting her head with my feet right now while I'm trying to do this. <laughs> and we've already gone through all those. All right. So we've got a couple new emails read. That's good. And now we're going to officially go to bed this time. Because I'm pretty sure we can't access the conference room yet. Because I think Warren's in there. But let's go ahead and try. I'm pretty sure we can't access this until the end of the game. Yeah, we can't. Okay. So we're going to... Annie! <laughs> I keep trying to stop petting her so I can focus on the game. And she keeps shoving her nose into my feet. Stop! Alright, let's go to sleep. Annie, you're making me multitask, and it's just, it's not, it's not cool, man. The following morning. Hey, Vidic. Time's wasting, Mr. Miles. Yeah, 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 gotcha. I'm coming. We're nearly done, you know. And then what? You'll see. Maybe they'll even let you watch when it begins. It's not as terrible as you think. <laughs> Look, I know you're not gonna let me leave. So why not tell me what's going on? Humor me. I'm not an idiot, Mr. Miles. I think you've already learned quite a bit. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course not. Uh -oh. All right, let me ask you something else then. Yes? Some of the stuff I'm seeing in the Animus, sometimes it seems wrong. Untrue, like the history is off somehow. It doesn't... It doesn't what, Mr. Miles? Match up with what you read on an online encyclopedia? What your high school history teacher taught you? <laughs> Let me ask you something. Do these supposed experts have access to secret knowledge kept hidden from the rest of us? There are books, letters, documents, all sorts of source material from back then. Some of it seems to contradict what the Animus is showing me. Anyone can write a book, and they can put whatever they want on its pages. Oh, Anything. Hey. <laughs> Used to be we thought the world was flat. Some people still do. Yes, and they publish books about it. Or that the moon landing was a hoax. I don't believe that. I believe there's also a book claims the world was created in seven days. A bestseller, too. <laughs> Where's this going, Doc? The point, I suppose, is that you shouldn't trust everything you hear, everything you read. What's that your ancestors said? Nothing is true. Everything, everything is permitted. Yes, exactly. It's part of what makes the Animus so spectacular. There's no room for misinterpretation. There's always room. Touché, Mr. Miles. Now that I've answered your question, can we begin? Yes, sir. I want to say something, but it kind of relates to a spoiler in AC4. Kind of, sort of, not really. But I don't know if I should say it. What are you looking at, Desmond? Stop it. Oh, don't be paranoid on me, bud. All right, let's go in. Hello. Hello, Lucy. It's time to go into the Animus. But I guess I'll just say it. <laughs> Semi, kind of, not really, spoiler alert. In one of the present day segments of AC4, John mentions, he's like, hey, did you know that Abstergo's run by tem Templars? Haha, <laughs> yeah, it's true, blah, blah, blah. Something about, you know, some people believe that the moon, the moon landing was fake, you know, yada, yada, whatever. And then Vidic just said the same thing. I just wanted to make that connection. So it's not really a spoiler at all. I was just a brainstorming. Shut up. When you're at a nine, 